Oh, I'm already sharing my screen, huh? Okay. Um, okay. So I don't know if I... I think I did some Runaway Boomerang sometimes, but not... I don't think I did it to the point where I should have been doing it, probably. Yeah, I feel you. Um, I also noticed a habit of yours, which I wasn't punishing very oh. well on Wi-Fi, yeah, yeah. but you're probably going to get in more trouble offline. You okay. tend to roll um, roll in um, after you get up from lunch, like, every time. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah. It's because, yeah, it's bad because oh, you do it too many times. You, yeah, you, yeah to exactly. It's not, a, it's not like a bad option, but you do it too much. So Do it too much, yeah, for yeah. sure. I know that, yeah. So that's... There we go. Okay. Um, right. So let's, can we go back to zero zero? Yeah, yeah. I'm looking for it. Okay. There we go. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Okay, so let's bring it. Let's break it down. So, so basically, um, there's there's the one thing I want to say, which again I think you have yeah. to be careful with more offline than online. Online, it's very hard to react to fire arrow. But offline, it's it's going to be a lot riskier for you to do fire arrow. So you're going to have to be careful about that. Because one of the things... You actually hit me for a lot of chip damage with fire arrow. And again, good. Like, you should... If you, if something works, just, just to be clear. If something works, keep doing it, right? So I'm not telling you not to do it. I think it's really, really good. But I, I'm trying to tell you, it's better online than it is offline. So you have to, like... You're going to have to, like, well, watch out for that. Well, I only play online anyway. So, it, so oh, okay. online training would be... Because, okay, yeah, I don't cool. Play much anyway, uh, so. in, in that case in that case even better but yeah because i i mostly play offline but yeah if you ever if you were to ever play offline then you know just watch out for that because like so fire arrow is like really really good online because it's like really hard to react um so yeah so keep doing it then um so yeah so basically look so what i'm trying to do you're you're this is really good like Again, even though you're not center stage, you're actually in a really, really good position because you're protecting yourself with platform. It makes me approaching you very awkward, you see, because because like Ooh, platforms are sticky. Like, yeah, um, platform. like how am I gonna how am I gonna like approach mm -hmm. you, right? I have to like fall through platform and do an aerial, but you can only do an aerial after you already fall through after you're already falling through the platform. Like I can't buffer an aerial above the platform and fall through the platform with it, right? So platforms are really, mm -hmm. really, really good for you. For camping like platforms are really good so this even though you're not center stage this is actually a very good position for you because you're protecting yourself cool. horizontally with boomerang and you're protecting yourself vertically with the platform so this is good yeah yeah cool, and again cool. in in your again your your um i would say I though the same mistake i did the same mistake yeah right through the boomerang the, and, the, and then yeah, the error exactly again. when you have boomerang out you probably want to be looking for either like if you have space, you can pull out a bomb. You just pull out a bomb. Yeah, yeah. you can either yeah. pull out a bomb or then you can um start like like if your opponent is so like again like if, if I'm being forced to jump for example because you, because boomerang is here, then you can start looking for an opening on your opponent, right? You can do like short hop fire to cover high, right? Or you can like mm -hmm. or again if, depending on the angle, depending on the, the character, you can look for an air. You can look for a forward air. You can look for an up air, right? So that's you want to yeah. you want to proactively you want to proactively zone them. And the way you proactively zone them is by stuffing out like the way that they're trying yeah. to get in. Um, yeah, I, this so, yeah. I understood. I just it, it's really hard habit to break, but I'm gonna break it. Yeah, 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 I understand fully, and I will work on that first. Yeah, so again, so this this is a good angle for you, right? Because like I can't land on you, you but you can do like an up air. Now, granted, I mean I'm probably gonna yeah. go past you, but this is still a good position yeah. for you. So I think I now you go for a oh, neutral no, air, which is not no. not super good because neutral air will actually lose a lot of things. If I hadn't double jumped, if I had come down with like a neutral air of my or, or a down air, then you would have lost Ooh, this interaction. Yes. So oh, so up air yes. up air is good, but neutral air is not as good at the at this angle, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, up there's better. Um. So yeah, look. Yeah, if you're back there, there's no way I didn't do that. So look at what that happened here. Um, <laughs> it didn't work. Whoops. <laughs> so yeah. here, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. So I'm. I have no double jump. Oh, it's okay. I have no double jump, and I'm above you. So now you know that I'm gonna have to yeah. land, and 
so basically you you have time to set up because like sure you you could try to like contest me directly again you could try to go for like a four like a neutral air or like an up air or something or you you have time to set up so again you, you have like space so here look you have like we're drifting away bomb. from each other yeah you can either pull and out bomb or you can wait for boomerang to um disappear and then you could throw out another boomerang well, boomerang is already out yeah yeah, because it's about to disappear. See, boomerang, it's like okay. it's it's dead now. So, but now instead, but instead of like, here's the thing. Mm -hmm. Here's the thing. So, so no, but leave it paused here because here's the thing. See how I'm running towards you because I want to punish the landing with a dash, but it didn't work. How exactly, come? and that's and, and what I'm trying to say is you have to recognize that you didn't have the spacing for that to work. Like, you, you mm. we weren't gonna we we're gonna be I'm close enough. Far. Yeah, you're too far. So so because you have to yeah, recognize that you're going to be too far, and therefore, that's why you have to like throw out like a boomerang or a bomb or whatever. Does that make sense? Yeah, you're... yeah, I'm too far. Yeah. I'm trying to punish the landing, but it's not, not going to work. There you go. Yeah, yeah. Good uh, punish on me. Tech? Yeah, because I, I, uh, oh, I, I, I miss my down tilt, right? So like I... I like you did a like a neutral get up like down tilt into up smash is a true punish, but I missed the timing on it. So then you, you whiff punished me. So that's good. Yeah. Um, yeah, so oh, see, see look, look at this, look at this, crazy. and again, that's because, <laughs> yeah, right Mithra is crazy, yeah. but also is because, again, you, you did, you see, like, um, how do I put this, shit. What happened? So, right here, like, this isn't a true follow-up, right? So, again, if you had, like, jumped and well, reacted, well. and you could have done, like, a fast fall up air, it would have been, like, a lot safer, because then it's, like, a frame trap. Oh. Um, yeah, on, on, like mm -hmm. if I air dodge, because because mm -hmm. Mithra's foresight is only active on like frames like two to five or something, right? So if you had like, do you know what I'm saying? Oh yeah. Yeah. So short hop oh, and okay. then into like fast fall right. up air is oh, better. Okay. Anyway. Okay. And then you did that the up tilt, which was beautiful. Yeah, good good air dodge from you to land. Now I try to get back to center stage. Yeah, and again, this is good. Like again, you're you're forcing me, right? You're forcing me to shield. You're using angles with your projectiles. You covered high with aerial. You covered low with boomerang. Like this is good. This is good. Yeah. Um. Okay. Now, now again, again, arrow. you have space. Again, this is an area. You like look. I'm I'm in the air. I can't get to you immediately. Yeah. You ha you have no boomerang out. You have no bomb out. This is a good opportunity for you to to pull something out because you're not close or, enough. Or... You're not close enough to me to like threaten me. And you probably want oh, to no. protect yourself with projectiles, but you're running towards me. Oh, yeah. Now, granted, you but got the arrow. Is. You what got the arrow, but and which is fine, right? But again, it's okay. um, you got a little bit close. Again, if I had like, if I had, okay, wait, if I had, if I had drift, about that because that happens a lot. Yeah. <clears throat> so, so here's the thing. So we're right here. So look. Because I do that a lot. Here, so look, right. I'm I'm not close enough to you. I'm not close enough to you to pressure you. So you don't you don't have to stop camping, right? Like you can keep camping. So actually, even if you want to camp with fire arrow, that's fine. Now the thing is, I think the problem here is that you ran up. See, like you're you're running towards me, and actually you're putting yeah, yourself in more I risk. That, and this is why I do it is because I want to come closer, hit you with projectile, so I can have a follow up. And, yeah, and, and a combo. That makes sense. No. Um, it makes sense, but the, the the thing about it is, um, you're putting no, yeah. yourself at, at risk. Like you have to recognize the distances. So when you're when you're running here, you're putting yourself mm -hmm. in into my threat range. So again, if I had played this a little bit better, if I had like kept um drifting forward and done like a forward air or a down air or a neutral air, you mm -hmm. would have lost this in interaction. So it's okay. It's okay That's to be like close enough to do like. Like a, a hit confirm off an to off of a, combo, a projectile, but, but you're yeah, still getting too close. Yeah. Like yeah. you can be close enough to hit confirm off a projectile, okay. but but this is still too close. Does that make sense? Okay, so then I should also where I was. Also, look at this. See, but see, this is you're, why the, I went for the arrow because yeah. I wanted to hit confirm exactly, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah but I like the other thing too is look at this now. Now you have a lot less protection from the from the for the platform you see that like now here is here's a clear angle for me to hit you you see this diagonal angle because now i can actually yeah. buffer an aerial from above and hit you again mm -hmm. this worked out for you because i didn't like i didn't drift uh, hard enough in but like 100 percent, you could have lost this do you see what i'm saying yes 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 yeah 
And actually, I lose it often, but I keep doing that. <laughs> because I feel like I need to have that hit confirm and just continue the momentum. Yeah, but you don't have to. You can you can play it. You you would I how I play in my games is I I go for the opportunities that like that present themselves. Um, I don't like. I try not to force something if it's unsafe. If that makes sense. Like if if like you're gonna find opportunities. Do you know what I'm saying? Like you don't have to uh -huh. force yourself into unsafe positions to get opportunities all the time. At least uh, not at at least not at low percents. Like it's okay. Comes... It's okay to like force like a kill at high percents. Mm -hmm. But at low percents, it's like you don't really need to risk it. Like there's not really a reason for you to risk it. Okay, okay. But what did what about the first uh like the very beginning of our session? I said something like I was waiting on shield. I obviously don't because know, that, because that's risky, anymore. right? It's because so so I'm talking about risk. Being in shield is risky. Right. So like it's about like, yes, you want to be creating uh, your opportunities, but like you want to be creating safe opportunities. That's my point. You were trying to create an unsafe opportunity. Okay. Does that make sense? So like, okay, okay. so well, it's, it's, yeah, it's what yeah, I was yeah. saying earlier. Like, yeah, like the fire arrow was fine. The problem with the fire arrow, even though, by the way, you hit the fire arrow, but the, you, you could have lost the fire arrow was fine. Was the problem was you were too, yeah. you're too far, far up. You could have been farther mm -hmm. back with the arrow and it would have been, you still could have like, you know, hit confirmed and, and everything, and you would have been safe, right? Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This up B, I was yeah. sus. I think I wanted to jump up B, and maybe I don't know. Yeah. That's see, look, happened. look at this habit. You always do this, by the way. And again, I, I wasn't I, punishing I know, it very well. I know. But yeah, you got to be careful with that. It, well, it's because I want to come back and and be have more space to move. You know. Yeah, yeah, come yeah. Come back on the stage. No, I I know, and it's because us being in the corner is really bad. But I'm just telling you. Yeah. You, you just have to, like, you're going to get punished because you do it too much. Yeah, I do it too much, I swear. I do it too, way too much. Uh, it's, like, it's, like, it's, like, it's like a super good option, but then, you know, the problem is that even if you do really good option, if you do it too much, it becomes bad. Yes. That's what I need to, like, yeah, yes. I need to, like, okay, put in my mind, you know. Mm -hmm. So, good. Um, yeah, that, that was all good, by the way. It's, we have the, uh, the yeah. hair. No. Oh, okay. Yeah, that that okay. Yeah, so see, that's the that's this is the angle we're about to cover. This is the angle that you were talking yeah. about. Yeah. So, so okay, so when okay, so then you need it to make when space. When somebody comes at that angle, do I need to back away, do the boomerang? That's like a yes. good point to do with that. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Back away, do a up angle boomerang. Yeah. Catch see them right here. Yeah, yeah, you could have you could have like uh, short hop back boomerang. Yeah, 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 that would be good. Because mm -hmm. then, yeah, my up, my up smash didn't come out, obviously. The angle, yeah, okay. Yeah. I think we're talking here. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I was talking about the up smash, actually. <laughs> Again, so... Okay. Okay, so you're covering yourself. This is good. Um. Yeah, this is good. Like, again, you're making it very hard for me to approach you, so... You are yeah. in the corner, but do you see that? Like you're in the corner, but because you have enough yeah. frame data to like take out projectiles, you're not in that bad of a position. You do you do want to get out of this position, mm -hmm. but you're not immediately in a bad position. It's not always bad to be in the corner, and that's sort of what okay, I was trying cool. to get at when we talked about earlier. Okay, so now yeah, now you're oh, you're getting stage control. Cool, that's fine. Cool, cool. Um, can you write that down? Because actually, I. Have... <laughs> I have a friend that thinks that stage control is everything. So if you can explain that, I, wait, did you say? So because Young Link has quick frame data, he can, he can cover himself in the corner. I don't know if you can write that. Yeah, down again, it, 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 and again, don't I get me wrong. Yeah, I I can do that. Um, yeah, don't get me wrong. I'm. It is usually better. Again, it is usually better to be like to not It'll be in the corner, the center, yeah. but it's not always better. Like it's. It's about yeah, it, yeah, like, yeah. Of yeah. Course, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but that's really, really important because it, they always think it's just better. Than... Right. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. This is fine. I do, my, I do have roll. Okay, this was weird. No, actually, no, wait, go back. I, did I just roll in up tilted? That was you really weird. did. But the spacing was what fine the on hell? it, though. Like, okay, so. But probably not. 
that's probably not something you want to do, right? Like, yeah, you I didn't. You didn't want to roll here. Like you didn't want to. Like the rolling. The roll was weird. The roll was weird because like you. Yeah, that's you, weird. Yeah, you're putting yourself in lag essentially here. Like you're not like you could have just like dashed or like walked. So yeah, the yeah, the roll was I, weird. I didn't, yeah. But but I after really after you rolled though, after you rolled, the up tilt was fine because um you you have your back facing me and like you're you're not close enough to do like back air. Like you could like jump back, but like again like that's like, that's going to be like an awkward position. So honestly, the up tilt is fine because it hits behind you. So like again, the the roll was weird, but the up tilt is fine. Does that make sense? Okay. Yeah. So I should have just run an up tilt at least if anything. But even though up tilt is not very a good move. Anyway. Yeah, down down tilt is safe on shield. Down tilt is Down tilt down tilt mm -hmm. is safe on shield. Yeah. Okay, down tilt is safe on shield. Okay, cool. Yes. Yeah, okay. Okay. Uh so yeah, so good. But then when if they're sh if they're shielding, you probably should go like right, grab and stand, but... Um well no, it's it's mix up. So grab is committal. Um you don't always want to mix you don't up, mix up, mix up. It's a mix yeah, up yeah. exactly. So cuz you yeah, yeah, yeah. You can you can go for a down tilt which is safe on shield and then force them force them to like pick an option because their shield is getting lower and then you can hit them with like an aerial mm -hmm. or you you force options. Like you force right. exactly, yeah. exactly. You force options. Uh True, true, true. Yeah. I like it. Okay, cool. Okay, so yeah, I like, I like the. This is a really good fade back boomerang. Again, you have your, your protect. Like, I don't have an angle on you, and you're protecting yourself with the platform. This is a really good fade back boomerang on your part. Um, All right okay. here. Okay. So but that now, yeah, you're... Now, here's actually a technical question. Yes. Should I approach you while I'm getting the boomerang? Because catching the boomerang gives the end lag. Too. Yeah. So it's that's a tricky that's a tricky thing to answer. Um. And it's again, it's yeah, gonna wow. be like it depends. So here's here's there's two there's sort of two things that I can say to that. Um, one is okay, okay. Um, one is you can actually jump over boomerang and you can bypass the um, the re grab. So you have it's an angle, right? So like if you, once you hit it, it's gonna be coming back like this way, and then you can actually jump over it. And actually, jumping over it is really good because not only do you skip the uh, re-grab animation, but then you can also do you can do a follow-up that's safe on shield. So you can do like a like a a forward air one on shield, which is safe on shield. You can like space that. So so like here, let me um thirty twenty. So look, so boomerang, you can do a dash forward, full hop. So Dash forward, full hop. You have to full hop like here, like here immediately. You have so you full hop, and then you you buffer forward air so that you you are landing with forward air one. You'll be like right here. It'll be safe on shield. So that's a good approach. Um, okay. So that's okay. one. And then that's second reason. Yeah. So that's one good reason. Yeah. Um, another good reason is it's going to be like spacing dependent. So like another thing you can do is it's going to depend on when you re grab boomerang. Because if you're like if you're actually like a little bit closer, um, so that like mm -hmm. you don't. It, here's the thing. Th this re grab is at a like is a, like a bit of an awkward range for you, right? Because you're going to be re grabbing it here, and you're like not close enough to like hit me with anything. But if you were already a bit closer, like let's say you had thrown boomerang like here, and so like so okay. now you, you're dashing, you can actually approach with with an like an aggressive attack and bypass the the, the re grab animation. So like you could do like you could be close enough to yeah, like yeah. run up grab or yeah, like dash attack or like neutral it, air. It won't, it won't pass. Yeah, so it's going to okay. depend on the spacing, basically. Um, if okay, you're closer, okay, okay, okay. if you're closer, you can do like an aggressive ap approach, right? Um, and if you're farther, then you can do like a safe, like um, spaced, like forward air on shield, something cool. like that. Perfect. Or okay. you, another thing you can do, and it, you don't always have to approach. Mm -hmm. Like you can also use boomerang um, as as to like a approach, wall yeah. to like pull out a bomb, for example. Oh. Yeah. So there, guess, there's different. Again, really? it's all mix-ups. It's all mix-ups. Like, like instead oh, of running yeah, forward, you can just pull out of a bomb. Like, it's just it depends on what you want to do. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 So, I did the nair because I probably was actually thinking about the boomerang regrab, and I'm like, nair mm -hmm. is quick. Yeah, it was good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know. All right. The ground. Uh, because I know it's gonna bounce. Is that good or should I go for the upwards? Because I don't know. I went for upwards right away. 
Mm. This, so here's the thing. So I um, I whiffed. I whiffed. So this was actually um, a true kill confirm on your side. You just had to do down tilt. Down tilt to um, up air or up B would have killed here. You went for an up tilt, which oh, up tilt. What did I do? Up tilt? Oh, yeah, man. you did up tilt. Oh, and okay. I, the only reason to do up tilt, like there's, there's two reasons to do up tilt instead of down tilt, right? So reason number one is to like um if you if you're trying to like catch a jump right like if like down tilt isn't going to catch yeah. a jump right and so they're landing on you you catch landing yeah, yeah. so so up up air is good to catch or up tilt's good to catch jump it's also good to hit behind you right like down tilt only hits in front of you like up tilt hits behind you so those are two good reasons to use up tilt but here uh, be here like you... and then why wouldn't you do a reverse four tilt then instead would that be better no so not not tilt, always I mean? no um because yeah. forward tilt has a different um it has a different hitbox. I'm also pretty Angle. sure forward tilt is slower yeah. than up tilt. So young link smash ultimate frame. Oh here. yeah. Probably yeah. like the same no? Or oh, maybe I don't know. It's it's also a timing question of like when something comes out. So like okay. Forward tilt is frame ten and up up tilt is frame nine, see? So granted Yeah, a little bit. But then also also granted that Obviously, the a, animations. A yeah, because this is nine to fourteen, front, so it's gonna hit. Yeah. It's gonna hit around like let's say frame thirteen behind you. But then in order to do a turnaround, if you're doing a frame perfect, it's one frame. So and this is active like ten through twelve. So it would it would hit around the same time. So it's almost like it depends on the angle because. Um, yeah, the angle is definitely different in boxes. As yeah, well, exactly. Because right? it's gonna be like this is gonna be hitting frame like eleven through. 13 if you do a frame perfect whereas this is going to be hitting like also frame 13 it's it's about it's about the same timing essentially it's about the same timing but this ha this has a better like anti-air hitbox so this this is actually better a lot of times to cover like um like a except i think that four kills uh four four till kills quick and uh, does it do more damage yeah, it it does not by much it, it does it does four percent more damage and it does kill earlier but um so yeah, I guess forward tilt here. I mean, but, but again, obviously, obviously at that point, yeah, I don't know. Again, like at that at, at this point, down down, down tilt was game. down tilt was the best thing. Down tilt was the best thing to be honest. or or yeah, down, 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 down smash. Yeah, definitely. Down tilt or down smash. smash. Down. Yeah. Do you think down smash would have worked? It's frame down nine, so three? probably probably would have worked because like you hit yeah you, it would have worked because uh, you you hit me with up tilt, which is frame nine, and down smash is also frame nine. So yeah, down smash would have killed. Oh, that's. Crazy. Okay, yeah. cool. That's crazy to know. Yeah. Okay. Down stress is really good. Uh it's a really good kill move. For real. Yeah. Okay, cool. Okay. Um okay. Uh, actually last question real quick. Would yes. a down smash would a down smash kill that that's the that down smash kill further than an up tilt and then bring to the ledge up B? Because yeah, up no, B has no, no. So a down, down tilt up B, down, down tilt up B is gonna kill the earliest. Down tilt up B is gonna okay. be the, the earliest. Down smash though, yeah. Um, down, down smash is is better sometimes for different reasons. So one is down smash can uh, can two frame ledge, two, um, down smash can catch ledge uh, hang. Can, can down tilt two frame though? Um, it's it's basic like on a lot of characters it doesn't two frame. And it's also oh, basically okay. impossible because of how the uh, hitboxes work. So like down smash okay. hits hits lower than down tilt, okay. and and it also hits okay. hits farther. It also hits farther. So you can you can space sometimes with down smash when down tilt won't reach. Okay. 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 Yeah. So the other thing about but down you smash. You frame a lot with with yink, right? You better just go off stage and do an air. Like I don't know, put like do pull up a, pull out a bomb though. Or say, say something. Again? There's like better options than two framing with down smash though. When you um, to guard it's the scat, though, no? not always. So it's gonna be again. It's gonna be um. It's 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 gonna be dependent on the situation. So like a lot of times, if your opponent, let's say your opponent is off stage, but you're like in the middle of the stage, right? You're, because like you just hit them at high percent, and they're trying to like recover. And let's say they have an exploitable recovery, like maybe let's let's say like wolf or or falco or fox, right? So they have to upbe, right? Let's say they have to they ha they're in an angle where they have to upbe, and you. Again, Young Link isn't like super fast. So let's say like you're in the middle of the stage, you hit them off stage. You're running towards you're running towards the um the edge of the stage. But by the time that you get to the edge of the stage, they're already up being. So you actually do not have enough frames. You don't have enough frames to run off stage. Because you don't have enough frames to run off stage, okay. then 
your only option is going to be to two frame with down smash. Okay, fair enough. Yeah. Yeah. It's uh, also it thing. just depends like uh, in terms of like sometimes you don't have an angle to like edge guard off stage so like down smash like two framing is better or like safer so th there's a lot of things to like think about for sure for yeah. sure for sure um anyway yeah. um so yeah cool so you caught my landing dash attack that's fine um cool again see boomerang is so good it protects you can I catch what should I catch landing with down tilt instead. Uh, if you you couldn't have you but couldn't have because you were though. you were you weren't gonna be close enough because you would have had to do like the dash cancel but down is it to harder too or is it about the same like no it's it's like, harder it's harder to catch a landing it's, it's harder to yeah. catch a landing with down tilt than with uh than with dash attack because dash attack yeah, yeah, is yeah. gonna come out faster and it's gonna um cover uh, more ground. it's gonna cover more yeah it's, it's a better anti air and everything yeah cool yeah. Again, so, so, the, so yeah, so I this is good. Again, you, you're you're covering high downstairs. and then you're covering low. This is really good. The blade, but goes in the air. Then I go the arrow. So this is good. This is what I. This yeah. Is what you said. This was good, and then and then look at this though. Now, now you angle. now you don't have anything, but you went for like a hard read, which is it's okay to go for a hard read. But I'm not. This won't. This wouldn't have even killed. So you're going for a hard hard read that's not even going to kill. This is very committal, and you don't have any projectiles out. So I actually don't like this. Does what that make you sense? Have done instead? I would have set up more projectiles. Yeah, so should I just kept going. Yeah. More projectiles. Okay. Yes. Or, or yeah. if you're gonna go for, if you're gonna go for a, a hard read to kill me, then you, like again, grab isn't gonna kill. So if you're gonna go for a hard read to kill me, then go for like a neutral air or a forward air or a down air or an okay. up air. Do you know what I mean? Like, like use something that will that'll kill if you're gonna go for a hard read. Okay. Okay. Good. Good spot dodge. Uh. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, um, you probably should have angled this up, but other than that, it was good. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah, I was trying to, because, yeah, you covered down, right? Oh. Yeah. Uh, right here, um, let's see, you caught me with an up air, I think? Yeah, that was good. Yeah, th this, that was solid. Nice. It's oh, really so, good. Okay, I did that. That was solid. That yeah, yeah, solid. this is all really <laughs> solid. So, Young Link, in, when you're ledge trapping with Young Link, it's really good to, like, sit at like roll distance like about like this right here this distance and then you can cover a lot of yeah. um options usually if you have enough frames you didn't you didn't have enough frames but if you have enough frames when like if someone's still recovering then it's good to like pull out like a bomb or like a boomerang bomb you can actually roll bomb um off ledge or you can time it to um you can you can time and space hard throw bomb to hit the edge of ledge of the stage you can like actually stage spike people um i have a clip of that actually um, well, oh yeah, you should, but that's probably like too hard to be consistent about it, though, right? I mean, it's is it? It's um, I don't know. It's it's pretty good. Like, let me let me show you. Yo, look at this where, where you stopped it. It doesn't even look like it hit you. <laughs> I know. Um. So here. Uh, where is? It? Here, here, here. So look at this. Um. Look at this. So, right here. So someone's off stage, right? And I, I can't contest. I can't contest this angle because mm -hmm. arms, right? Arms are coming out. So then I back off. And so because I'm having to back off, I'm like, okay, well, I might as well do something with my time, right? Um, so I pull out a bomb. And again, look, I'm too far. I'm too far to like hit him with anything, right? So then I'm like, well, I already have bomb in hand. Mm -hmm. So I might as well throw it. Yeah. Stage spike. See? So you you can do that. Ah, that's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. That's you, funny though. Yeah, yeah. Like, so if you have enough frames, it's it's good to do stuff like that to like throw bomb um to, to like stage spike people, or you can also like throw boomerang up, right? And then like that way, like if they if they get up from ledge, then like they're gonna run into boomerang and then you can um you can obviously like hit confirm with like a forward air, right? And but and then and then if they're forced slow, then you can like grab them or you can like down tilt them, right? Like it's good to like force options. Now again, you didn't have enough frame data, so you just reacted, and that's still like that's also really good because obviously if you had like thrown a projectile, then you would have like been in end lag. So it's good that you recognized that you didn't have enough frames to pull out a projectile. But usually, usually if you have enough frames, then it's actually really good to like set out um projectiles because the other thing too is like let's say you throw like an upward boomerang and so they're they're gonna like maybe they don't want to like get off ledge because they're like pretty like they're like they're a little bit worried about getting off ledge right um so then now you can mm -hmm. actually uh run up right here if you right here like right here right here 
down smash will will yeah. um will hit ledge hang and then you'll kill them and down smash the other good thing about down smash oh, yeah. is it, it sends at a really good angle it sends them down and out so like a lot of characters can't recover because of the angle they're going to be sent at yeah a um it's it's 50 and like i'm i'm tired now so yeah it's been two hours i thank you so much you have no idea when is it going to be uploaded by the way um yeah so i'll send you um i can upload it today and i it's going to be uploaded to uh yeah, just my my youtube channel um so and i'll, I'll create a playlist in case uh because there's going to be multiple parts to it because of how how uh, like because i was having to like um stream this on discord so there will be like three parts but i'll create a playlist for you so you can you can easily find it um that'd be yeah. really cool if you could do that yeah, yeah yeah i really appreciate you so much no yeah uh thank you okay i'm gonna stop streaming now and um then we can uh, talk more details.